now coming to the third bit which is 3x minus 5y minus 4 is equal to 0 and 9x is equal to 2y plus 7 so first let us rearrange the given equations that is after rearrangement the equation becomes 3x minus 5y and minus 4 is transposed to right hand side we will be getting it as plus 4 and this equation is rearranged as 9x minus 2y is equal to 7 so this be equation number 1 and this be equation number 2 first let us solve the given pair of equations by elimination method So, multiply equation 1 with 3, that is 3 times of 3x minus 5y is equal to 3 times of 4. So, 3 times of 3x is 9x and 3 times of minus 5y is minus 15y and 3 times of 4 is 12. So, 9x minus 15y is equal to 12. So, let this equation be number 3. So, now adding equation 2 and equation 3, we get 9x minus 2y plus 9x minus 15y is equal to, this is 7 and this is 12 so if we add equation 2 and 3 uh, neither x nor y term is eliminated so we need to subtract equation 2 from 3 that is 9x minus 2y minus of 9x minus 15y is equal to 7 minus 12 so now we will be getting 9x minus 2y minus of this is minus 9x and minus of minus 15y is plus 15y and 7 minus 12 is minus y. So, this is second equation minus third equation. Now, plus 9x and minus 9x will be cancelled and minus 2y plus 15y is nothing but 13y which is equal to minus 5 this becomes y is equal to minus 5 by 13 so we have found the value of y to be minus 5 by 13 now let us substitute y is equal to minus 5 by 13 in equation number 1 that is 3x minus 5 times of y is nothing but minus 5 by 13 this is equal to 4 now we will be getting 3x minus of minus 5 times of minus 5 by 13 is nothing but plus 25 by 13 and this is equal to now transposing 25 by 13 to right hand side we will be getting 3x is equal to 4 minus 25 by 13 that is 3x is equal to now here the LCM is 13 we will be getting 4 times of 13 minus 25 and 4 times of 13 is nothing but 52 this is minus 25 divided by 13. 52 minus 25 is nothing but 27 and this is divided by 13. Now we got 3x is equal to 27 divided by 13. So x is equal to 27 by 3 times of 13. 3 goes in 27 as 9. Therefore x is equal to 9 by 13. And we have found the value of y to be minus 5 by 13. 
therefore the given solutions for the pair of linear equations are x is equal to 9 by 13 and y is equal to minus 5 by 13. Now let us solve the given pair of linear equations by substitution method. So the first equation can be written as 3x is equal to 4 minus 5, 5y is transposed to right hand side we will be getting 4 plus 5y and x is equal to 4 plus 5y divided by 3. Now substitute the value of x which is 4 plus 5y divided by 3 in equation number 2. We will be getting 9 times of x is nothing but 4 plus 5y divided by 3 and this is minus 2y which is equal to 7. Now 3 goes in 9 as 3. So this becomes 3 times of 4 plus 5y minus 2y is equal to 7. So 3 times of 4 is 12 and 3 times of 5y is 15y minus 2y is equal to 7. So 12 is transposed to right hand side we will be getting 15y minus 2y is equal to 7 minus 12. So 15y minus 2y is nothing but 13y and 7 minus 12 is nothing but minus 5 that implies y is equal to minus 5 by 13. So we have obtained the value of y as minus 5 by 13. Now let us substitute y is equal to minus 5 by 13 in equation number 1 so as to obtain the value of x that is 3x minus 5y is nothing but 5 times of minus 5 by 13 which is equal to 4. So we will be getting 3x minus 5 multiplied by minus 5 is plus 25 divided by 13 which is equal to 4. So 3x is equal to so 25 by 13 is transposed to right hand side we will be getting 4 minus 25 by 13. Now taking the LCM which is 13 so 4 multiplied by 13 is 52 and here we have minus 25. So 52 minus 25 is nothing but 27 divided by 13. So we obtained 3x is 27 divided by 13 that implies x is equal to 27 divided by 13 multiplied by 3. 3 goes in 27 as 9. So we got x is equal to 9 by 13. Finally, the required solutions for the given pair of linear equations are x is equal to 9 by 13 and y is equal to minus 5 by 13. Coming to the second problem, form the pair of linear equations in the following problems and find their solution if they exist by the elimination method. The first bit given is if we add 1 to the numerator and subtract 1 from the denominator, a fraction reduces to 1. It becomes 1 by 2 if we only add 1 to the denominator. What is that fraction? So let us see the solution for this problem. In this problem, we are required to find a fraction which is subject to certain conditions. So let us assume the fraction to be let the fraction be x by y here x is the numerator and y is the denominator so let us first see the first condition that is when one is added to the numerator and one is subtracted from the denominator the fraction reduces to one our assumption of the fraction is x by y so when we add one to the numerator it becomes x plus one and when we subtract one from the denominator it becomes 1 y minus 1 so this is equal to 1 according to the given problem 
by cross multiplication we get x plus 1 is equal to y minus 1 on rearranging the terms of this we get x minus y is equal to minus 1 minus 1 which is x minus y is equal to minus 2 name this equation as equation number 1 now by the second condition it becomes 1 by 2 if we only add 1 to the denominator so the numerator remains as x and 1 is added to the denominator which becomes y plus 1 so this is equal to 1 by 2 on cross multiplication we get 2x is equal to y plus 1 so re on rearranging the terms we get 2x minus y is equal to 1 so name this as equation number 2 so we have to use the elimination method in order to find the solution for the equations 1 and 2 equation 1 minus 2 gives x minus y minus 2x minus y is equal to minus 2 minus 1 we'll be getting x minus y minus 2x plus y is equal to minus 3 now minus y and plus y will be cancelled x minus 2x is nothing but minus x this is equal to minus 3 so finally we'll be getting the value of x as 3 so let us substitute x is equal to 3 in equation number 1 substitute x is equal to 3 in first equation x minus y is equal to minus 2 implies in place of x we can put 3 minus y is equal to minus 2 so minus y is equal to minus 2 minus 3 minus y is equal to minus 2 minus 3 is nothing but minus 5 that implies y is equal to 5 so we obtained the value of x as 3 and the value of y as 5 we have assumed the fraction to be x by y so in place of x we can write 3 and in place of y we can write 5 hence the required fraction is 3 by 5 coming to the second bit 5 years ago Nuri was thrice as old as Sonu 10 years later Nuri will be twice as old as Sonu how old are Nuri and Sonu? So let us see the solution of this problem. So let the age of Nuri be x and age of Sonu be y. According to the given problem, 5 years ago Nuri was thrice as old as Sonu. That is x minus 5 is equal to thrice as old as Sonu this gives three times of the age of Sonu is y minus 5 this equation can be written as x minus 5 is equal to 3y minus 15 x minus 3y is equal to minus 15 plus 5 which gives x minus 3y is equal to minus 10 name this as equation number one now using the second condition 10 years later Nuri will be twice as old as Sonu x plus 10 since we are talking about 10 years later so this becomes x plus 10 is equal to 2 times of age of Sonu 2 times of y plus 10 so by second condition we can write x plus 10 is equal to 2 times of y plus 10 this equation can be rewritten as x plus 10 is equal to 2y plus 20 and x minus 2y is equal to 20 minus 10 that implies x minus 2y is equal to 10 name this as equation number 2 so we have to find the value of x and y by elimination method so equation 1 minus 2 gives x minus 3y minus of x minus 2y is equal to minus 10 minus 10 that gives x minus 3y minus x minus of minus 2y is plus 2y 
minus 10 and minus 10 give minus 20 plus 6 and minus 6 will be cancelled minus 3y plus 2y is equal to minus y which is minus 20 so we will be getting the value of y as 20 now let us substitute the value of y in any of these equation let us substitute this in equation number 1 x minus 3 times of y is nothing but 20 will be equal to minus 10. x minus 3 times of 20 is 60 is equal to minus 10. So, x is equal to minus 10 plus 60. That implies x is equal to 50. So, we have obtained the value of x to be 50. Therefore, the age of Nuri is equal to 50 years and age of Sonu is equal to 20 years.